Hello everyone. In this video, we're going to find the equation of a line that is parallel to another line and passing through a specific point. So this is the example I've got through here. First thing I'm going to do is to work out the coordinates of the points A, B and C. So I'm just going to read it off the scale. I can see here the coordinates of A. Well, that is 6, negative 3. The coordinates of B is a neg a 0 and positive 1. And then the coordinates of C is 0, 5. Okay. So I'll zoom in so you can see it. Basically, what I want to find is this line that I'm drawing for you now in purple. It's a line that's parallel to this one, but it cuts through this point C. Okay? Parallel to the line through AB, so parallel to that line, and it passes through C. So I'm going to draw it on. So it has to be parallel and then go through that line there. Sorry, go through that point C. So that's the line we want to find. Now, I'm going to use the one weird trick I did in a previous video. I'll put the link in the description box where I said for every equation of a line, I need two things. I need the gradient. I need one of the points. So let's write down what we can find out. First, the gradient of this line, I know, has to be the same as the gradient of this line. They have to be the same because these lines are parallel. So I want to find the gradient of this point to this point. Uh, to work that out, you can check out my video on finding the gradient. I'll put the link in the description box below. But I've worked it out before, so here it is. Gradient is negative 3 minus 1 over 6 minus 0, which is negative 4 over 6. So that's negative 2 thirds. I'll write it in my box. The gradient is negative 2 thirds. Next, I want to write down one of the points on the line. So the question is, which point am I going to use? Uh, is it this one? Is it this one or is it this one? Is it A, B or C? The question tells me the line I want is passing through C. So one of the points on the line is this C point here, 0, 5. So now that I have this information, I can work out the equation of the line. So for uh, more detail in how that's done, you can check the previous video where I talk about this. But I'll just do the working out quickly here on the side for you. So here's my equation. And then y is 5. m is negative 2 thirds. Multiply it by x, which is 0, and i plus c. So c is the value 5. So here's my answer. y equals negative 2 thirds x plus 5. 